Okay, so first we start with an A4 piece of paper. This is a slightly thin card, but you can use paper. It's a rectangle, we need to make it into a square. So corner, up to the line, so this is equal all the way across, nice fold across, nice and crisp, that leaves you with a rectangle here. You need to fold this over and remove this, you can do it by scissors, or you can fold it. And then tear, not always that simple, it just takes a bit of practice. Open it up, we have a square. Okay, now you have a fold across here. Let's fold from corner to corner to create another fold that goes across that fold. That gives you a nice cross shape like that. Okay, so start with the corner, go to the middle. I'll mark the middle so you can see where it is and where we're working towards. Corner to the middle. Turn it around, corner to the middle. Open it out. Now, you will see that there is a fold here. This corner must go up to the fold. Once you've done that, you must fold over alongside that fold and fold again to the middle. So it looks like that. Turn around, repeat. Corner to the first fold, fold, fold to the middle. If they overlap slightly, don't worry about it. Try and get them to meet. Like that. That's our first. That is a tie. That's the tie. If you turn it over, that looks like the back of a tie. Now, in the middle you'll see there's two folds that go across. I'll just mark them so you can see them. There. This is tricky if you're not used to it. You grab hold of this flap here, put your finger on the corner there, literally. Keep it down and pull this down so this creates a fold and you fold in the corner. So let me show you close. You bring this down and you can see how it folds across there. That's the trickiest fold in all of this. Do the same on the other side and you get this shape here, like a collar. Now pull this down so that the corner meets in the middle and fold at the top and it creates this shape. This is our first dog. Two eyes, little triangle for a nose. There's our first dog. Fold his ears in. His ears become folded in. The nose is folded up. create that and then you fold this up to meet the top turn around and repeat it takes some practice with these particular folds again we've created another collar pull it down so it naturally folds at the top we have our second dog triangle for a nose okay fold his ears in fold his ears in fold his nose up and then be careful just to fold the top bit up like that you might not meet to the very top but try 
turn it around and then we have our box with lids there we go the lids don't shut but they do open like that okay put that back down turn it over now on the back you will see there's a fold that goes right across here I'll just mark that in just so that you can see it there you now need to fold this is a bit tricky you've got to fold the whole piece sideways into the middle now this is more difficult with mine because it's card it's easier with paper turn it around fold the whole thing over now as you can see I created that that doesn't meet that it can do it doesn't matter it's not that important because when you now turn it right around open these out like little doors and push that forward turn around keep them open and push that forward and then fold it down and there we have either a mirror or a picture frame now the last fold is could be quite tricky so we've got a picture frame we turn it over now you need to fold it up that way what I tend to do is this like that okay you can do it that way I can put it down and you can go like that but it must look like that now you hold it there you hold it there and you want to you're now going to nip it tightly but not too tightly because you want it to slightly move the paper inside this is going to go up in this direction this is going to go up in this direction both at the same time now very slowly just tease it apart you see there's one gone the other one's a little bit if it's a bit tough hold it and let it go let it go and that's it what you don't want is for it to tear too much it's a bit of a tear there if it's a bit stubborn there we go then on the top you pull this top flap out on the other side you pull this top flap out be very gentle with it and there we go we have our boat this boat will float but only if you put some tape right across the bottom it will float anyway for probably about 20 seconds and then it'll get all soggy and sink on this one it's got a little hole in anyway so a little bit of tape across the bottom and we've got your boat so we started off with a tie we had two dogs we had our box with lids and then finally we have our picture frame or mirror and a boat Thanks for watching.